This video shows the creation of a frozen river in the snow. It is created for my new Blender course, created for Blender 4.1. And if you'd like to know more, you can look at the description below what this course is all about. So let's get started with this river. So we start with a plane and we're scaling this so it has a size of 50 meter. We're shaping it a little bit so we can draw a vertex paint. So blending two materials, some rocky and a forest ground. We add a displacement on the materials and then we paint another vertex paint map on the terrain so we can add some ice. We're making a node setup so we can blend the rocky surface with the ice so it blends perfectly together. All right, so then we import some scanned models of rocks. We blend these with snow. We're adding some cliffs on the left and right and we're adding some snow on it. Then we're shaping the terrain, so I'm covering the sharp edges of these uh, scanned models. We're lowering them so they blend well with the terrain and you can use as many versions as you want. Then we're focusing on trees and we're using 2D flat planes as a backplate in the scene. We're making some duplications, then we switch back to the viewport. We're aligning them in the background and I'm adding some layers so it adds some depth in the scene. I'm also adding a volume box and that will generate some mist in the scene and in combination with the ATRI it casts lovely light in the scene. Next we add some snow and we're using the particle system to get this working. Uh, using a simple snowflake and some wind and then we blow all the snowflakes in the scene. We're baking it and then we can see this in motion. And when enabling motion blur in the scene we can see some blur on the snowflakes that looks realistic. We animate the mist, then it's time to add some motion in the camera. And when this is all done, we can render the scene and we can see the result of all the hard working. Thanks for watching and bye bye.